Yeah, this van's pretty cool. But we can make it cooler with these tank treads. Oh yeah, check those puppies out. No more wussy little tires. Now you can run over the bad guys like Shredder. Oh, he's gonna feel that one in the morning. Human Bebop. Ow, that's gonna leave a mark. Metal doesn't even stand a chance. He's aluminum foil now. Run over a slice of pizza. Delicious. Run over Peppa Pig. Why are you so cruel? This will be a cool addition to your NECA van. But wait, there's more. Spring action, just like the cartoon. And just like the cartoon, you can launch your turtles. Kawabunga, boing. Just a disclaimer, the spring doesn't really spring. Check it out, all four turtles fit into this platform, just like in the cartoon. How cool is that? Whoa. But just when you thought it was over, there's one more thing. Whoa, holy moly, where did that come from? Rocket launchers on top of the van? No way. Now you're fighting with power. Rocket power? <laughs> oh, yeah. Rocket launcher, spring, and tank wheels all sold separately. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that little commercial I made for these uh, accessories. <laughs> uh, in my defense, it was a spare of the moment type of thing. It was just something random out of the top of my head. Uh, it was like a last minute thing. I, I, I was I was like, I, I have to make a little ad for these accessories just to give it a little bit more excitement, you know. <laughs> so I threw it back in, you know, the old school 90s uh, commercials when they used to make commercials for action figures. Anyways. Uh, these things are on sale for whoever is interested in them. Um, let me give you the rundown of the pricing and how to order them and um, how it all works and how to install all this stuff into the van. Everything should be user friendly. Uh, it should be easy plug and play type of deal. Uh, it should be effortless for you guys when it comes to um, plugging these things in and getting your shipment um in your hands so uh the way i'm gonna make it is uh first come first serve and um and uh made to order so what that means is that uh there's gonna be a list of people uh depending on what number you are in that list is when i'm gonna make your stuff for instance if you're number one of course i start making all your stuff uh everything is is 3d printed and um this usually takes about two and a half days to print this usually takes about a day to print this usually takes about three and a half days to print just for the two of them so yeah it takes a while uh because i wanted to make them as hardy as possible so you won't be able to break them i mean they're still kind of fragile because they're uh, 3d prints uh, but then again if you bend this that's gonna break too you bend this it's gonna break so you just, basically it's like a neck of product <laughs> if you will uh so just be careful with it it is a 3d print but i made it as sturdy as possible as i possibly can um so the way like i was explaining the way it's gonna work uh first come first serve so whoever orders it first uh whatever they order i'm gonna work on their stuff first and then once i'm done i'll go to the second person and third fourth and fifth and so on and so forth uh so that's gonna work um a lot easier for me more it's gonna it'll be a lot effortless for me to get everybody's uh shipment done and shipped out to you uh shipping is separate from the price the prices are fifty dollars forty dollars and sixty dollars for the pair so uh and then shipping on the side and the way shipping is going to work is uh so first of all first of all let, let me say that uh the payments done as uh, due up front uh, i take the payment up front because um and there is no cancellation uh simply because let's say you you order something and then this thing's printing out like already halfway and then halfway through the print, you send me a message saying, I don't want it anymore. I just lost PLA and I lost time where I could be doing somebody else's stuff, you know, and it's not fair for that other person. Or it's not fair to, for me. So at least show me a little bit of grace, please, because this is me all by myself. Uh, I don't have any help. I'm not a factory. I'm not a company. I don't have 100 hands dealing with these things. It's just these two hands painting and printing everything. So if you guys could be graceful and, you know, be thoughtful and know that i can't really cancel anything so 
Uh, that's why I'm asking for the money up front. Uh, and there's no cancellations. Once that money is posed, I start making your stuff. I start printing everything out. And again, just to be clear, no cancellation. I will not send money back. I will not do anything like that. So please, please make sure that you have the money and you're financially okay for you guys to pay these things and um, before anything. Uh, just so you guys are aware, if let's say uh, right now you can only afford this, right? Uh, pay for this and then put yourself on the list again. And whenever we come back to you, you could order this or or you could order this, whatever it is. Uh, you could order one thing at a time if you want. You could order all three things at the, at the same time. And what I'm going to do, too, is that you could only order two of each thing at the same time. So you could order two of these, two of these and two of these or two sets of these at the same time. Uh, no more than two of each thing uh, that that comes back to the same thing of uh, other people waiting in line. You know, I don't want them to wait so long for uh, for their shipment or for their stuff when they order it. So uh, that would kind of suck for them. You know, I don't want them to wait too long. So that's why it's only two of each thing. So uh, the reason why this thing is blue, uh, the blue, the camera is picking it up a little bit darker blue, which is not that dark blue. Uh, I don't know. You could put it in the light and it makes look makes it look better. But uh, this is like a grayish blue. This is the same. This these two are the same colors. It's just it has more white in it, so that's why it has a different tone to it. Uh, but if you look at this picture, that's the that's the beginning credits of the turtles uh cartoon and you see that it's blue and i like to make things more screen accurate uh than anything else so i love to make it look as screen accurate as possible but i know some people won't want this and i do have a gray one for those of you who are interested in gray i know a lot of people i know more most people are going to be interested on the gray one because it's more planned and you could just it's a neutral color and you could just it matches with this thing and when you put it up here let me show you guys that's what it looks like on the van itself so I, I i could understand why people would like this one but i know there's for, there's a toy photographers out there that uh like to be more accurate as 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 far as screen accurate in the uh, as a cartoon to take photographs of it i personally like the blue one better but you know which you know would whatever flows your boat whatever you like better but anyways just let me know when you guys are ordering it um when you guys send me the email asking for their orders just let me know whether you want the blue one or the gray one, uh, or you could get both, being that you guys could get two of each thing. So you could get either or, or you could get both of them. Um, okay, so the way you order it is you have to send me an email uh, at recreating at gmail.com. Uh, in the link down below or in the description down below, you guys will see my name. That way you won't misspell it. You guys got to send me an email asking me what you want to order. Um, and then I'll send you... I'll reply back to you, letting you know your number, and I'll let you know the price of everything. Well, I'll let you know the total amount of everything, and uh, that way you could go from there. And then shipping, the way shipping is going to work is that once everything is done that you ordered, I will uh, message you, letting you know, and sending you a picture of the stuff that you ordered. And once I get your okay saying that everything looks good, um, I'll let you know. I'll, I'll pack it all up. Uh, and then I'll send you a message showing you the USPS uh, rates. So you could do express rate or three-day rate or five-day rate or whatever it is that they have, uh, whatever options they have. And I'll let you know which ones they have. I'll show them to you. You'd let me know which ones you want or what option you want uh, to ship it on. And then um, you send me the money for the shipping and then I'll ship it out to you. Simple as that. Okay. So once I hope all that's clear. Um Oh, uh, and I take PayPal, Venmo, and Cash App, and I'll let you know what, what my links are once you order the stuff, and that way we could go from there. Um, so yeah, PayPal, uh, Cash App, and uh, Venmo. So if you guys have any of those three, uh, I could accept it that way. Okay, so now into showing you guys how to plug this thing. So it's very, very easy. I made it effortless for you guys as possible and efficient. Uh, so you guys could just plug and play. Uh, I measured everything out, which this took forever to uh, make. It was just trial and error because I had to get the sizes perfectly fine in order for it just to be able to pop in and pop out. 
the good part is that you don't have to change anything like you don't have to do anything to anything you just basically connects to the van um like i said i try to make it as efficient as possible for you guys um so basically just pop it in bam there you go and now you have some uh some tank uh treads uh for your minivan if you guys saw the episode for this thing it did have a little rack up here and then it had the the turtle skis up here which i am working on right now but um i need more money to buy more uh filament so uh, that's why i'm setting these guys out first hopefully i make enough money so if you guys if you guys have a friend or somebody please share this video with them so they could know about this because the more money i make the more stuff i can make for the van and i do have a lot of plans for the van and other figures and so on and so forth so uh i have a bunch of ideas um so if you're not following also please follow and share this video with your friends and that's the reason why i'm selling two for each person just in case you do have a friend that doesn't know my videos or never seen my videos i should say or doesn't know me um you could order a second one for your friend you know so you have two you could give one to your friend whatever so um anyway so yeah you just plug and play so you just plug this in and then unfortunately i can't make these wheels turn because it'll be this itself took me forever to design and everything and then and then to make the wheels turn it'll it was just going to be a pain in the butt so uh but you could still roll your car around the only thing i could tell you guys is that back here being that the way that is designed uh this bumper sticks out a little bit more than than the van itself so you get a tiny little gap there just a tiny tiny little gap but it's not i mean it's not really that noticeable but it's there just so you guys can see i know i know there's some there's some people out there that are really uh that are really ain't know about their uh <laughs> about their uh stuff so just letting you guys know that that's the way it's gonna look but I mean, I really love these treads because they look so freaking cool. And then it makes the van look super bulky, which I love. You can see the van, the tires in the back. I love that look. But, you know, that's just me. And I'm trying to sell some stuff. <laughs> but uh, as, a, as a collector, I think it looks really cool. All right. So as far as uh, the spring goes, it's easy to uh, clip, clip on too. Uh, there's little notches right here on the side. And then all, all it does is just sit on these, on the walls, on both walls. So if you can see these little walls right here, it just sits on there, but it sits on there firmly. So you just gotta, can't see it from here. Let me, there we go. So it sits on there firmly and then it's nice and firm. So it's not going anywhere. It's just stuck in it. And like you saw in the video, you could put all four turtles on there. So that's pretty easy to put on as well. And also I designed it that way because I didn't want um, uh, take up, I didn't want it to take up space down here. The original design that I had, it actually came all the way to the bottom. And I was just thinking like, why would I do that? Like, why would I take up this space when you could just put a turtle here or you could put something else here and then put a turtle up here. And you know, it's just putting more space into the van, um, more free space for you guys in the van. So that's why I designed it that way. And also, let's show you how to put the rocket launchers on. So the rocket launchers, they have the little tabs right here. Uh, you just take these little tabs off. They're pretty easy to do uh, on both sides. You take these little tabs off and now you have two little holes right here. And all you have to do is plug your, your missile launcher there. I have to put these little pegs here. All you have to do is look for the pegs, put the pegs in the hole. And it fits like a puzzle piece. I try to match the colors as as good as possible. You know, there's they might be a little bit lighter or not, but you know, it's it's as close as I could get it. And then it looks like a little hatch opening, so that's why it looks like that. And then these guys, you could turn it whatever way you want. You could turn them uh, individually if you like. Uh, let me use both hands because it's pretty hard to do that with one hand. So you could turn it right and then you can make it look down you can move it forward and back and then back there so you could turn it left and right up and down and you could move the missiles as you please uh so that's it that's basically it uh if you guys are interested uh send me an email like i said first come first serve first person that uh orders it from me um uh, 
start uh, start their shipment. Once they're done, I go to the second person and the third person, and forth, so on and so forth. I will answer everybody's email. I should I'll let you know the number that you are in line. That way, you, you get ready and you get your num your money ready, your money situation ready, and then when I get to you, then you could pay then and there, and then we'll go from there. All right. So that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, thank you in advance for those of you who do support me and, you know, buy some of this stuff from me. I appreciate you guys. Uh, please send these videos out to your friends. I uh, appreciate that too. Uh, and if you like this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe because if you guys do, guess what? You guys will see me on the next one. Peace.